Alright you guys, we just got to Crossroads, so I'm very excited to go inside, um, see what they have. They usually have pretty good bags at this particular store, so I'm really, really excited to see what they have. I'm hoping they have some good stuff. I'm looking for gifts, looking for stuff for you guys, so uh, let's go inside and see what they have. I found this really cute Michael Kors bag, $65. A little expensive, but it's super cute, so it's a maybe. I have this Marc Jacobs laptop for 28. They have this cute Kate Spade for 32.50, half off, but it's like really damaged. They have this one too. This guy is 42. They have this cute coach. No crossbody strap though. Net, net. This guy's been here for some time too, it's Michael Kors. I think I might take this one, it's half off. They have this cute Michael Kors fabric bag too for 32. Especially Mishka is cute also, but... They have this Kate Spade fabric bag. Does it have a crossbody strap? It does. Half off 55. I have to give you guys a sneak peek of what I got. Do you see that? Ah! Okay, let's go. Greetings, Citations YouTube. It's Hayden here. Welcome to another edition of Goodwill Hunting where we go to various Goodwills and see what treasures we can find. I'm super excited today because it is a bright, sunny California day. It's the second day of December, so I'm super excited for that. Don't forget to check out my Vlogmas episodes because they are going to be like pop in right now I'm super excited about that as well um, but if you guys want to see more of my thrifting videos hit the line right there the window will pop out and you can select the playlist there for more thrifting videos haul videos handbag rehabs and vlogs and if you'd like to have it done so already don't forget to add me on Instagram and Facebook it's hatering just like it's spelled here and don't forget to check out my shop at it's hatering.com to see what I have for sale for my thrifting ventures and I marked down a ton of stuff so I have lots of gift ideas over there for you guys as well and treat yourself too stuff for yourself so let's go inside the store and see what we can find all right you guys i'm going through the handbags first to see if they have anything oh, i think this is an audrey brooke bag i've seen the crossbody strap though and the pleather doesn't look to be in the best or pleather um doesn't look to be in the best condition i don't think it actually pleather though. i think it might be um patent leather which is nice but eh. Joy, Susan, Marona. This looks almost like a Rebecca Minkoff, but it's not, it's Carlo. Anne Klein, Jacqueline Smith, Fake Birkin. All right, don't see anything really in this handbag section. Let's go look at the other stuff here. I just found this gorgeous BND bag. I don't know if I'm gonna get it. Has like the, I don't know, there's like a lot of wear on the handle strap. The rest of it seems to be in pretty good condition. It just needs a solid cleaning, I think. But I don't know, it's $9.99. So I'm gonna hold on to it and think about it. Oh, how cute. Oops. But this is Stob. Ooh, heart shaped Stob. Sold $4.99. That's adorable. Oh, it's Spider Woman. Oh, that's cute. A little side table. $50? These were at the other Goodwill for $10 each. Still looking for like large glass vase. Not seeing any. I'm checking out the stuff that they have. This is really pretty. $14.99 for that guy. This is pretty interesting. I've seen like vases like that and I love them. That'd be so cool to find a vase like that. I would be like over the moon for sure. I thought this was broken, but it's not. It's like kind of scalloped edges. <laughs> made in Romania. Ooh, it must be like really nice glass. That stuff that's made in Romania is very, very nice. What is this? Smith and Hawken? Oh, these are from Target. This one does not have a price. Oh, there it is. $4.99. Cute. That large glass, like. I don't know if it's a hurricane, but it's not exactly what I'm looking for, but it's cute. I like that Buddha head. These are pretty nice, albeit expensive. West Elm, $14.99, $39. Decorative use only. They're both expensive. 
but they're West Elm. They're pretty too. Thought they were like maybe Target. They're nice and heavy, but they're scratched. Check it out, they have like this Starbucks mug. But no for that. But this giant glass thing is kind of cool, $14.99, but it's really huge. I don't know, is that too big? These are super cute. I think these are Threshold. Yeah, these are from Target. They have like the two sizes. That's really cute. I'm thinking about these for like putting coffee inside of. So we're gonna have like a cute coffee canister. I think they don't have prices on them. Yeah, I don't see prices anywhere. Should I ask? Oh, it's a Pelican toothpaste, toothbrush. It's going to up right there. That's really cute. Eat, drink, and be thankful. These are cute. I feel like they sold these at Costco and they were full of like biscotti or something. Because I think we actually owned that. I'm just looking through these things. I think this is a Pampered Chef and it is $6.99. Little pricey for something this small, but... I'm this is the big version of the Hearth and Home Lantern that I found. $24.99. $15. Cute. Don't know if I should get I kind of want that, like, this is a larger size and it's really cute. But $14. I don't know. We'll think about it. And these are so cute. These letters for Santa. Adorable. Oh, how cute is that? How cute is this? $10? Oh, so cute though. I'm kind of dying over this little lettuce pitcher. $10, that's so expensive. So I don't think I'm gonna get it, plus it looks kind of cracked inside. I don't know, I hate like when it has hidden cracks. If it was like $5, I'd probably get it, but it's really cute though. Whew, cute. All right guys, this left the Goodwill. I'll show you guys what I got when we get home. All right guys, we just at the store. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed going thrifting with me. Don't forget to subscribe so we update when I do post a whole video for this and I'll see you guys all tomorrow. Bye! Greetings and salutations to YouTube. It's Ian here. How's everyone doing today? Hope you guys are all doing fantastic. Welcome to a new video. Today we are at the Goodwill. Hoping to find some treasures. If you guys want to see more of my thrifting videos, I have the link in the top right hand corner and down below in the description box as well. And don't forget to check out my shop at itsadrian.com to see what I have from just for sale from my thrifting adventures. And don't forget to check out my Instagram and Facebook, it's Hadrian, just like it's spelled here. But without further ado, let's go into the store. Going through the handbag. This is a Perlina, but hmm, it's kind of cute. Perlina is not my favorite. Charles and Keith. This is like a cute, like vintage style bag. Fake Perlina. I think that's it for the handbags. Let's go check out the rest of the store. Perfumes, Givenchy. They have a ton of these like poof things. And these, like, these are the ones with the marble tops. 44, 49, 49. All at, like, different prices. There's the Christmas tree. There's this marble thing. I think it's like $49. A little pricey. There's this carpet, which is kind of nice. Blue. What is this? Oh, a pillow fort. Oh, it's a little teepee. Carpet. This is festive. Threshold, how much is this guy? $27.99. Let's see what vases and stuff they have here today. Oh, these little pink ones are so cute. I've been seeing them at various Goodwills. Oh, this is nice, but it's not big enough for the size that I'm looking for. Checking out the plates and stuff. Great and barrel. Oh, this is like a little heart shape. You know, I found a heart shaped thing earlier too in another store and it was dog. That one's cute though, but I don't know. But he found one heart shaped thing today. Don't really need too many, I think. What is this? Oh, it's a little tray. What's this? A serving platter? Oh. Oh, they have like some Thanksgiving trays with turkeys on them. What do we have over here? That's kind of cool and fun. 
toaster, coffee things. These are pretty. These are like brand new from Target. Look at this silver owl. It's so cute. It's threshold. So it's Target, $6.99. It's kind of cute. They have these little planters. They're kind of cute. They're like woven baskets, but they're all chipped. There's three of them in different sizes. Look at this mirror. This is kind of cool. Look at this sofa. It's cool. It's like rounded arms. This little table is kind of cute. This round mirror is pretty nice. 40 down to 25. There's a Tory Burch bag here. $40. Kind of cute. All right, you guys, we're at another Goodwill. Let's go inside. They have this bus, and it's like thirteen dollars. Not too bad. I already have like a mannequin type deal. Now I'm just looking through the furniture. They have this new loom rug. It's seventy dollars. It was originally one seventy-two. It's a sheepskin rug. And tufted, so it's like a fake sheepskin. It's kind of cool. I think I might be interested in this. Check out these bowls. These are pretty cute. Very festive. Vase. Checking out their vases. Oh, this one looks pretty promising. Actually. Pretty large. It's $12.99, but it's a little cracked on top. But I think green might be half off. Yeah, I'm gonna get it. It's only gonna be $6. And it's the biggest one I've seen, so I really wanted something <laughs> badly. So there are little like chips on the top, but it's not the worst. And I'm just checking out the rest of the store and seeing what else they have for me. This wall decor branch is really cool, but it's $17.99, so it's Tad pricey. I think this is an outdoor table. Cool. Let's see what else they have. I really like this carpet. I kind of want to open it up just to see how it looks. I'm going to see if I can do that. Guys, look at how amazing this vase is or whatever this is. It's really, really cool. I kind of like it. It's $7.99. What do you guys think? You guys, this plaid rug is so cute, except first of all, it's not centered. Like, it's like a little off. And also, I don't want it to be green. Check out this cute little heart-shaped Joy Rich LA for the sports sack bag I found. These marble top tables are actually half off, so this will only be $20. I'm considering it. 80 to 20 these would be cute, like by the pool. I don't know, what do you guys think about this? Hey guys, okay, so we're back at the house and I wanna show you guys what I got. Now this is gonna be kind of um, a culmination of two thrift hauls because um, I went earlier in the day I did go to Another Goodwill as well, and that was for, I put that in my vlog in this video, but I didn't get to film a haul till today, which is like two days later. Uh, so, I'm going to show you guys what I got from this haul video, or this thrifting video, as well as my thrifting session in Vlogmas day one, if you guys want, or day two, if you guys want to check that out. So I'll have that link um, up top and down below as well. And let's get into this haul. Oh, and I also did go to, um, what's it called? Crossroads. So I'll show you guys what I got from there as well. Um, let me start off with this stuff. Um, no particular order or anything. Um, so the first thing that I have here is this beautiful empty box. Uh, if you guys remember this, it's like this little truck toy that I found at the Goodwill. This was only four dollars and ninety-nine cents, but Eliza has already grabbed it. Like he saw me holding it when he when I walked into the house, and he was like, "Truck!" So I had to give it to him already, but I have this as. Um, I don't know, just show, show you guys that I got this truck because it was really, really cute. And it's cool because it still came with a little guy as well, so... Super excited about that. Love getting him, like, little trucks and stuff from the Goodwill, little toys and whatnot. And this one was actually brand new in boxes. This is from Target, so, um, yeah. Then up next, I have... So I had to get this really cute, 
uh, vintage um, Snow White mug. It's so adorable. Um, it's made oh, made in Japan, made exclusively for Walt Disney World. Um, I don't know what year this is from, but I'm pretty sure it's vintage because I don't think they have these anymore. Like they don't make cups like this anymore. So really, really cool. And Snow White, love it. Then up next, I have this cool pot. Um, I don't know where it was from. I don't know. It was probably for like an orchid or something. But I love these kind of pots that kind of look like stone or cement and like wood. It's really, really cool. This one was $3.99. So I had to get this. I'm really, really excited for that. So I could put like a really cool plant in there. Then I found this really nice um, tissue holder. <laughs> <laughs> and this is actually from Restoration Hardware, which is really cool. It used to be $40. I got this for $2.99. And it, honestly, I think it just needs to be cleaned up a little bit. And then it's going to look like good as new again. So, uh, just had to get it. This is going to be perfect for, like, the living room. And I can put this, like, on, like, a little table or something. Um, so if anyone needs to blow their nose or whatever, there's, like, so many allergies and everything right now. This is perfect. So I'm really excited about that. Then I got this really, really cute heart-shaped stub pan, like cake pan. Um, it's in like this red color, which is really cool. It does match a lot of the vintage, or a lot of the thrifted Lake Lucy pieces that I've gotten from the Goodwill, which is pretty cool that I found like one that matches, and it's Staub though, but Staub is also like an amazing company that makes amazing cookware, bakeware, and all that stuff. So that's another one. Like, um, we collect um, Lake Lucy and Staub and um, um, Emil Henry, um, anything like William Sonoma, like, I'm there. So, really excited about this little cake pan. Super cute and red. Oh, this is like one of the first things that I found when I went to the Goodwill and I'm really excited that I found it. And it is this gorgeous red, like, I don't know what this would be called. It's called a vase bowl, <laughs> I guess. And it's really funny because the Pottery Barn sticker is still on here. So it was originally, $59 down to $22.99, which is, yeah, I guess it went on sale at the store. And now I got this for the lower price of $9.99, which is totally worth it. This is an amazing piece. I actually have other pieces from this collection, but they're in white, not the red. But the red is so festive, it's going to be perfect for the holidays coming up. So I'm going to definitely use this in my holiday decor. So I couldn't be more excited to have found such a great quality, amazing piece for such a amazing price. So, very happy about that. $9.99 hot dog. I can't wait to show mom. I actually haven't shown it to her yet. And it's been like a few days since I got it. It's just been like sitting. <laughs> but, yeah. So, I was very excited to have found that guy. Oh, and then, okay. So, if any of you guys, um, are any of you guys like sci-fi books, like readers and all that stuff. I am like such a huge like book fan. I used to work at Borders. I have a million books. If you guys have seen the library, I have tons. And... One of my favorite authors is Terry Brooks, so shout out to Terry Brooks, his books are amazing. Um, the Shauna Chronicles are really, really popular, like I don't even know how long that series is, but it's like super long. I honestly don't even know if it ended, um, not that big of a fan I guess. Even though I have a lot of his older books from when I was younger in high school, I like read um, like Castle in the Attic, um, the Shauna Chronicles, like awesome. And most of them I have are in paperback. So I definitely didn't, don't have any of the Shauna Chronicle books in hardbound. And when I found these two, I was really, really, really excited. Um, these were each like 99 cents. So I just got them. And now I can just add them to my collection. So I'm very excited about that. And then last but not least, um, my favorite piece that I found, I think, is this beautiful marble top round side table. And it's in... Um, like a shiny silver and then the marble top. This guy was $40 but he was half off at the store so I was very very excited to have got this guy. Um, this is gonna go outside. I'm gonna put it in between the two um, lounge chairs by the pool because I wanted like a table over there. Um, I'm going to like I don't know I don't know if like this will, like the metal will be okay outside so I am going to like spray it down with something that will hopefully prevent it from rusting. If it is going to rust, I don't know. But again, it was only $20. So even if it does rust in the future, I'm totally okay with it. Um, and the marble top is like ageless. It's beautiful. I love it. And that rounds out. Oh, and let me show you guys what I got from one of them. It's actually up 
Whew. over here and it is this beautiful um my oh, alexander mcqueen this is like a diamante um clutch it's so beautiful it has studs all around it the details are exquisite now this piece was a little pricey i'm like standing like right here it's like awkward this price this piece was a little pricey it was 200 dollars um at crossroads but totally totally worth it. it still has all the tags it has the dust bag and everything it retailed for 7.95 so about 800 dollars down to 220 so i think that this is an amazing amazing deal um and it's such a cute clutch if i can't sell it i know like someone in my family would love it or use it i would use this like i mean how fabulous is this it'll fit all my stuff in it so i always like want to pose with it like this <sighs> high fashion poses but it's so 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 cool i love it immensely oh and then i have my other piece right here sorry i don't even like i'm like so unprepared right now so I had it sitting on my bookcase, but check out this beauty. It kind of looks like Michael Jackson's jacket from Thriller, but um, it's such a beautiful Burberry bag, bright silver, exquisite, still has the dust bag as well. And this was originally um, $300. It was on sale for half off, so I got it for $150, and it's in such amazing condition like I like there's like virtually no wear at all on this bag and it's just stunning it's nice and oversized but the leather is so 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 soft you can carry it on your shoulder you can carry it in your arm in your hand and everything so um, I'm gonna put up these two pieces for sale if anyone is interested um, they're exquisite pieces I'm so excited to have them up in the shop so check it out at it's hadrian.com and check out all the other stuff I have too. So many great holiday gifts for your, your loved ones, your friends, yourself. Um, <laughs> so I have a ton of stuff up there and I've marked down a lot of stuff, especially things that have been there for a while. I've marked them down considerably, so don't forget to check them out. And I love you guys immensely. Um, don't forget to tune in also for more Vlogmas, doing Vlogmas for the whole month. And I'm super duper excited. I'm gonna still try to do two videos a day. So I'm definitely gonna do a Vlogmas episode every day and then like another thrifty video. So two videos a day for the month, like, I know it's a little overkill, but that is what I promised I would do and I'm trying to stick to my word. So thank you guys again so much for watching. Love you guys immensely and I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye. This room, and then I would actually put this carpet in my room. So that's another thing I would actually like to try to do. And that zebra would actually look pretty but I think I actually might try that maybe on Friday. Definitely can't do it tomorrow. Um, tomorrow is gonna be really fun because we're gonna do we're gonna go to an Orange County Goodwill event. So I'm gonna bring you guys with me tomorrow. There's gonna be a holiday style event by 